But the reality for me is that when we think about behavior change, behavior is the wrong place to start. It always has been. <laughs> it's mind boggling to me that the entire rehabilitation industry marks it as success if you're not drinking, but you're still miserable. You can be not drinking and suicidal, you're a success. You can be not doing drugs and completely miserable in your life and it's a success. And how I describe this is, is basically a four-step process that is just mirrored after this idea of unconscious incompetence. You move to mm -hmm. conscious incompetence, then you move to conscious competence. And that conscious competence where you're doing the thing, your behavior is changing, but you have to use willpower. You have to consciously mark that behavior change every single time. I was like, we would never, stop there in any other growth narrative. You would never stop there walking because then you would never learn how to run. You would never stop there. But in our industry, you stop there. That's where it stops. That's where it stops.